Welcome back to East Book 1 and 2 on the TurboGrafx CD. We're in East 2. We're on the Ice Village. We just got out of the Hotlands. I'm gonna get all these people we've never seen before. Rami Village. Cool, thanks. Old water well in Evan's house. Water's out of this world. Man, you know you're living in a society when... Man, the water in that guy's house? Mm-mm. You know, I think the sad part was, was when you said, you know you're living in a society, and my first thought was, bottom text. <laughs> <laughs> Just to say, like, there's, there's Naka's meme for the day. You're living in a society, bottom text water. <laughs> uh, goons were on a manhunt the other day, and my daughter Maria was caught. Oh, no! Okay, let's check off all our quests that we're getting in town here. Save Maria. Uh, did you just hear that bell? That is the signal that starts the sacrificial ritual. They must have offered another one of the villagers. Okay, so literally somebody just died. Cool. What else we got going on in this town other than people dying just while I'm walking around? Talk to me! I uh, wish I could do something to save the villagers, but being offered for sacrifice, but I can't get into the shrine. If only I looked like a goon, I could sneak my way past the gate guards. Well, have I got a rod for you. Don't take that the wrong way. Yeah, I was gonna say, it's like, uh, do you wanna... Oh, hey, sword lady. This is that Shovel Knight thing all over again. It's like, you can blow me all you want, I ain't going anywhere. It's just like... Oh, there geez. was wind! I know there was wind, but it's the perfect out-of-context, like, Oh, what? Ooh, 20,000, that's kind of expensive. Oh, wow. We, like, don't have any armor. Wait, have you not literally had armor this whole time? I mean, we've had, like, the cheapo stuff. You literally have so much money now, you go back and buy that one potion. Well, I mean, I have the money. Let's go ahead and buy the rest of these. Just buy out this sword lady's store. Why is the good stuff up at the mountain? Yeah, like, I've been using the chain armor all this time, because... I forgot. <laughs> no, um, we were unable to get better armor. Uh. Though we talked to the guy in the first town, and he was like, if I had ore or something... Which, like, maybe there was a place to get ore up before now? But if there was, I sure don't know where it was. But anyway, now we have the hypercutter and some heckin' good armor. So we should be pretty well off, I imagine. Okay, talk to both kids, talk to you... What are you? Harat's house. My son Sada has been missing for three days now. I thought his, I thought he said soda, and I'm like, I'm leaving. I'm done. Oh yeah, you're leaving after we had to deal with the demon Keith. <laughs> Coincidentally, our family sword is also missing. I hope Sada has taken it with him. Maybe that's it. All the humans have, like, real bonkers names, and all the monsters have, like, normal names. Yeah, maybe see, that's, that's just, maybe that's just a thing. That's what I was thinking of last time. I was like, yeah, maybe that's just it. Maybe it's just like the humans get the weird names and the demons get our names and then they go like, oh, that's obviously a demon name. And it's like, dude. Yeah, I don't know where he could have gone, but I'm starting to worry. Uh, you have not seen him, have you? Okay, so we've also got Sada is missing and the how Sword is missing. So we got a lady a missing, a dude missing, and the dude probably took the sword. Uh, I don't know. There seems like a lot of people in this town. It seems like there's more people in this town than there are houses to house you. Old man Evan used to love exploring the halls of the tribe, but ever since the goons came, it's been too dangerous, and he has been in deep depression. Me too, bud. I feel you. Um, I'm an old man now, and I don't have long to live. Why should I care what the goons do? I don't know. That's not depression. That's... 
this bitterness. I am Deca. I know exactly who you are. You have a great reputation which precedes you, Adol. I had a strange dream last night. You were in that dream, Adol. There was also a charming young girl who, who spoke of you and said that I must help you. How marvelous that you're here now. I sure do. Oh, by the way, uh, this is Solomon Shrine. The thing we've been trying to get to all game? Right here. It's been completely overrun by monsters. Okay, so we gotta go talk to that guy again. But yeah, our, our pilgrimage here is complete. We are ready to actually go into Solomon Shrine, which again is completely overrun by monsters, so... Probably fine. Yeah. Uh, he must have gone there to save Maria. She was captured by the goons for their sacrifice. Yes, I got that when I talked to the outside. If you're going to the shrine, will you please bring my son back? Yes. I refuse. I'm going there anyway, and I'm going to kill all of the monsters, but your son? He's fine. Uh, please take the shell with you. You will be able to communicate with me from great distances. Going real Rohan there at the end, aren't you? <laughs> it's like, I refuse. Okay, well, we didn't get equipment, but um, we got that. That cool? So I got the Voca shell from out uh, Let me unlock the door for you. Please hurry. Not you hurry. Let me in! Let me in! Ow. Well, let me tell you, I can't kill them. They got some... They can't hurt me, but boy, do these guys have a rock in defense. Okay, so uh, what we have to do here, because... The lady Ow. outside even said as much. We've got to be... What are you waiting for? You might... Well, wait, really? Cool. You're just gonna let me through? Are you saying that you killed Adol? I'm sorry, who killed Adol? Me. How dare you? I mean, look, I've got Adol's sword and his armor and everything, even this stuff that he just bought in town a second ago. Maybe he really did kill him. All right, I'll open the door for you. Go report this yet to Yetai. I, I love how the fact that he's like, barely showed up. Like, this is his second adventure, and it's, like, taking place immediately after his first one, and everyone's like, oh, crap! Don't let this guy anywhere near us, even though we just heard about him somehow for some reason. Well, it's it's a combination of that there has been a legend that even the demons know about. That's some... Not necessarily a legend, but, like, the, the goddesses said... We're going to leave all these books down there, and when a brave hero manages to get these books together, we'll know that that guy may actually be able to help us with our problem. And hey, guess what we did? And then we killed Dark Fact. <laughs> who Dark Fact was not to be hecked around with. Um, mm. In fact, Dark, Dark Fact is the reason all of these demons are here in the first place. He's the one who, like reopened the doors and let the demons in. So, like, we killed him? Friggin' everybody's on high alert. Like, who's this friggin' Adol guy that just killed Dark Fact? What the crap? Okay, so we can go in. Cool, and now that we're inside, um... Ha ha, I gotcha! Oh, dude, we were just about to have a... Okay, so, Solomon's Shrine. Uh, you can leave it. But this is effectively the Darm Tower of East 2. Yeah. Solomon's Shrine is like 50% of the game. So, I don't actually know a lot about the layout in here. It's big, it's confusing... 
So I'm just gonna kind of run around for a little bit and get a feel for the area, see what we're up against. We're not going to spend all our time in the Solomon Shrine. Like, don't necessarily worry about that. But, like, it's kind of all Solomon Shrine. Do I have... I do have the thing. Ah! Dang. Okay. That takes me somewhere. I'll get back to doors. I'll get back to doors. I'll get back to doors. I mean, I want to look around. I want to get a feel for what is, what's going on around here. Hey, go down here. Cool. Okay, so we have a staircase over here going up. Is that the same on the other side? That's where we came in, I think. And it looks like yes. Wait, so we have a staircase down there. And we have a staircase down here. Okay, that's just on either side of it. Got it. Cool. Making my mental map. Figuring it out. Okay, so this is just a big loop that goes around. That looks like the outside passage from the place that I went in before? Yes. Anything cool or unusual down here? Okay, so that goes up. Presumably, this just does the same thing on the other side. So let's check out up. Where does up go? Oh, up goes to a different screen. We are supposed to be going to the right? Um, guy guard said something about third floor on the right or something. So if we have to take a pick, let's choose that way first. area looks like it's doing the same thing. Yeah, it looks like it's mirrored. Okay, first screen. Not too shabby. What do you got for me, second screen? Long passageways that hopefully go somewhere. Okay, cool. What do you got for me, third screen? So you can go up through here. Got a guard over there. Hey, buddy, can I come in? Very important meeting is going on in there. I can't let you in unless you have the pass. The pass to what? You know, the pass. Okay, so we got a building over here. Leads to nothing. Cool. I can appreciate that. There's like not even anybody. Well, there's this guy. I was gonna say there's like not even anybody up here until there is. Yeah. 
wizard staffs yet. They don't do wizard stuff, actually. Yeah, they just kind of walk around and beat me with them, I guess. Ooh, funky place. What's going on here? I only vaguely know where I am. Committing this whole thing to memory is going to be rough. Okay, before we go that way, let's keep going this way. Make sure this is a dead end. I mean, at least you're trying. I'm not even paying attention. I've gone elsewhere, my friend. I mean, that's understandable. I have disappeared into the aether. Hey, I accidentally... Hey, buddy. So you wish to see Yetai. I'm sure he will want to examine your evidence. He is in a meeting right now. You can find him in the North Conference Room. We got the pass! Cool! It's like I've disappeared into the Aether. I used the wrong spell instead of return. I what, used... What do you mean I can't kill him? What BS is this? Hey, he's just a human. <laughs> just some guy. Yep, just it looks looks like a monster, just a person in actuality. Oh, and then this is where these two doors were. So I don't think the other one went anywhere of value. This one only kind of went anywhere of value. There's a lot going on over here, though. A lot of doors. Could I get to that door? I think I could. Gotta go around the long way again, just because I want to make sure I didn't miss anything back here. Oh no, that was a door I came out of here. Well, that'll show me. Okay, so I think we have actually done everything there is to do over here. Or at least everything I that I can think of doing. I gotta say, this music's really calming in here. It's nice! It's like... I don't, I don't mind rocking music a lot, it's just... I don't know, when I'm adventuring, I kind of like a nice calming soundtrack and everything. Especially over long periods of time, it's kind of hard to keep your adrenaline up the entire time. Yeah, so it's, it's, like, nice, I, I... it's nice to have the adrenaline when needed, but just as like a casual sound. It's, it's the, uh, it's, uh, I love Insatiable, the boss theme for Shadowbringers. Hmm. But, man, you, you can only listen to that so much before you just kind of go like, eh, okay. Okay, that's where that guy is. What was this way, though? This takes us back to screen two, which we never really did anything on. Okay, we can go under that. Okay, that's just there, I guess. We got doors! Y'all want doors? Because we got doors. Okay. Does this just take me to the other door? Oh, I think it does. But what's this? Cool. Also go up. Where does up take me? Got a door up here. Hey, buddy. You look like someone who knows things. There seems to be an intruder in the shrine. Yet I went to the North Conference Room to meet with his advisors on how to deal with the situation. Yeah, well, um, 
Sorry about that. Can't kill him either. How could they possibly know I'm here? Death, death, death. <laughs> uh, some of those guys were actually getting some cheap shots off on me. I know, I was about to say, I looked up and did that whole death, death, murder thing, and you were at 30 HP out of, like, what, 200-some? Yeah, I think I'm at 210. Well, can y'all just, like, leave me alone for a second? <laughs> just want to get my HP back. Okay, so, uh... Um, there was this up here. Which took us down to the bottom floor, which we've also not looked at. Those mages are slow. He's not. He's got places to be. Got places to be, people to hit with my staff. Yeah, you know, you could stab. You, you could cast stuff with that. It's like, I could, but... Hey, 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 hey. He's excited. Guys, I think I saw the intruder. If only I could just jump over the ledge. Uh, oh, there's two doors down here. Is this the one that came out of? I think that's the one I came out of. Great. Love it. Y'all couldn't put a friggin' single treasure chest in this castle with good stuff in it? Okay, I think our job here is done. Is it, though? No, it's not. Okay, that does mean, though, we can start backtracking and actually get out of here. I mean, on the upside, I've got a pretty good feel for the right half of this shrine, though. Because this was the main place that I feel like I didn't actually explore. Oh, I'm looking at my MP going, why isn't that number going up? Uh, where did I go? Where were we going? It was up here to the right. Yeah. You may enter now. Wait, oh, no, he's walking around. Heck. Open the door! <laughs> Okay, a few other small areas up here to explore, but we're probably pretty close to our destination. Passes that way, passes this way. This probably just loops around there. Sure does. And this place is huge! Okay, we've got a door up there, and then we got down here. Oh, these guys with big ol' shields? Oh no, I don't have... Yeah, I do have my magic equip. Why aren't I using magic? Oh, there we go. Hitting the wrong button again. Oh, you can magic them. There's one of these guys that actually blocks your magic. Okay, so we got a cool-looking door up that way. Was there a cool-looking door up this way? No. But there may have been something up here. A wall. With a couple more cool-looking doors. Neither of these looks nearly as cool as that one door, though, so let's go ahead and poke into these.
You know, I'm not gonna lie, I just saw a meme from Gaston doing that whole trying to read from the book that Bell has at the beginning, and my first thought was, it had nothing to do with what I expected it, but my first thought was like, first, a scholar in their first thing going like, how does this book work? And I was oh, just like, yeah! Is that the first thing that came to mind when I saw a person with the book? is like, how does this book work as my scholar? The peace of mind ring. I'm gonna take a m wager. I don't actually know what this ring does, but I'm gonna take a wager. Well, I thought it would regen MP, but it's sure not doing that, so I don't know what it does. I mean, you're at peace, aren't you? I mean, I guess. Yeah, I actually have no idea what that ring does. Was there another split in the path up here? No. Okay, well, that's it for that room. All we've got left is the one cool-looking door, so let's go check out the cool-looking door. <laughs> oh my god. I think I just read the best comic that explains us here. Hmm. Person talking to their brain. I tried my be uh, best. Brain. No. Okay, but I, g I gave it a good shot. Also, no. <laughs> It's locked? What? Well, heck. Uh, I just saw that and I thought, <laughs> for some odd reason, it just clicked with me. It's like, this is like not going to post just for like, for funsies more than like, oh, I'm feeling down. It's more like, this gave me a good chuckle. All right. Well, um, I'm going to say until next time, we've explored about as much as I can think to explore over here. I think that's where I'm supposed to go. Let's poke down here real quick and make sure. I think that's where I'm supposed to go, and I don't have a key or anything. Is this one of those where you're... Wait, no, um... Excuse me. Hold up. You're trying to find all the treasure chests kind of things? Well, I'm just sort of, but I'm also just kind of poking around. I'm gonna go back in here because I think I missed. I think there is something I can do in here, actually. I just have to remember. Yeah, it's locked, sure. Uh, what about these? Really? Is this another you put the earring on thing? Or? No. I was thinking you could do something here, but I don't know what it is. Alright, well, until next time, everyone, we still technically have a lot more shrine to explore. And then I've got to figure out what exactly it is that I'm supposed to be doing right now. Which escapes me at the moment. Unless I'm just missing something down here. I have an idea of what I'm supposed to do there, but... I don't know for sure. Yeah, because know. it was just right here. This was... Yeah, and then that goes up and loops around. There's nothing else here. And the other side of this is this gate. So, yeah. Whatever we have to do, it's up here somewhere. So until next time, everyone. I'll figure it out. <laughs>